My name is Peter Glenn Kalulo, a Tier 3 engineer for Avaya, Scopia, and Equinox team. In today's tutorial, we will be demonstrating how to enable auto attendant support in the Equinox management server. Okay, for the first thing, we, we're going to need to log into the Avaya Equinox management server to enable auto attendant support. So let's go there and make sure you log in as admin. And what we'll do is we'll go to settings, meetings, and then underneath will be auto attendant. And here you'll see the interface to change any of the settings for auto attendant. You'll see that it's enabled uh, by default here. And just a, a quick note, um, the auto attendant feature provides like quick access to meetings hosted on Equinox media servers or Scopia Elite MCUs, allowing meeting participants to access a video menu and select menu options using DTMF. And please note also, um, to enable the auto attendant feature, you must configure a meeting type with auto attendant support and then uh, configure the auto attendant settings uh, like you see here. And if we go over the settings really quickly, it would be uh, actually, the, the default IVR number would be 1-800 or the auto attendant number. Uh, that's default. Um, here, the allow create meetings. Um, if you select this, it'll allow guests to create meetings by dialing the auto attendant. Um, prompt for a meeting pin while creating new meetings. Um, this will prompt regular users to enter a meeting pin when creating new meetings. Uh, display all meetings uh, on auto attendant. Uh, again, this will display all ongoing meetings on the auto attendant. Operator call number, um, uh, the star zero for operator call. Basically, uh, if you enter the internal number that the system calls to reach the operator after the, dial, after the user dials star zero. Uh, and automatically route incoming calls according to schedule, specify the auto route number. Um, when you configure this, um, you route all meetings hosted to the um, Equinox media server or Scoop, Scopia Elite MCU to the auto attendant and assign a unique auto route number, which is used by the uh, gatekeeper uh, to route calls to the Equinox media server or Scopia Elite MCU. Uh, please note the number cannot be the same as any of the following. An auto attendant number, uh, Equinox media server or Scopia Elite MCU meeting type, a virtual room prefix, uh, gateway service, um, and last a H23 uh, gatekeeper zone prefix. Uh, so after that, let's just say you, you've configured what you needed to configure. All you would have to do is just press apply and that's it. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.